case to your king's tree, but what will happen if we say no to every decision that we make? Honestly, this is a pretty fun and challenging way to play the game, so stick around and watch the video till end. By the way, we got a new DLC, friends and foes, so we're gonna get a bunch of new events and storylines in this campaign. And while we're doing this challenge, we'll go through this decision here, unite the West Slavs, which requires to hold all of this region. We're gonna play as this dog in Poland in 1066, so let's choose our lifestyle. I'm gonna choose a store chip because I wanna get this perk that we can use claim serum scheme against our leech. And let's immediately get the claim on this guy. And let's get a strong ally right away. And marriage. There we go. It seems my leech wants to grant this vassal to me, and I'm getting a claim on him, so I'm gonna change that. I'm gonna get a claim on this guy right now. And it seems my leech want to get another vassal to me. Okay, the first decision here. I'm gonna say no, of course. Not a big deal. Okay, let's get a claim on this guy. And now I'm gonna get a claim on this county because this is a pretty good county as you can see and let's see clever on this guy to get this county and here we go we managed to win this war let's enforce our demands and I'm going to increase control on this county let's change this guy as well this guy is let's choose this guy Okay guys, now let's use Kalim Serum scheme against my Lich. And here we go, we got a claim on this county. So let's see Clever on this guy right away. They got an ally, but his ally is my vassal, so he can't join the war. We got their army right here. Okay guys, we managed to seize your capital. Let's catch their army. And now we're gonna just get point from controlling this war target. And here we go, we managed to win this war. And boom, we got this county, which is really good. I'm gonna increase control on this county right now, because this is a better county. Guys, look at this, we can be allied with Kingdom of Denmark, so let's do that. We need a strong allies to fight our leech. Okay, 90% chance to get a claim on Kingdom of Poland. And here we go, we got the claim on Kingdom of Poland, so... I will go to the hunt right now to get some prestige and keep my stairs as low as possible. Here we go. So let's see clear war on Kingdom of Poland. I'm gonna call my ally of course. And we're gonna raise our army right here. Okay guys, let's start to catch their army right here. Sure. And now let's try to siege the right capital. Let's try to catch their army again. Guys, let's try to catch the army again. Here we go, we are all the way to 94% war score. By the way, my ally just left me because they are fighting in another war. And finally, we got a son. That's a pretty good name. And we managed to win this war. Let's enforce our demands and get the kingdom of Poland for ourselves. Here we go. Look at this artifact. We're gonna get a lot of piety from this. Well, normally I would say yes to this, but you know the rules. And let's host the feast to celebrate our crown. Oh, that doesn't look very good. Okay, here we go. We have 6,000 and we only have 2,000. Let's call Denmark to the war and I'm gonna try to get another ally here Nani? holy cow we can be allied with William okay guys we got 2000 here nice why we don't have any commander 
Guys, let's get some knights from my prison. And let's marry my courtiers to get more knights. Based on prowess. Look at this guy, 28 prowess. Matrimonial marriage, of course. England is here, by the way. Let's rise our knights right here. Okay, guys, we got a big stack right here. They're coming in as well. Mm, that is okay. Okay, guys, we are going in again. This guy is raiding us. Let's kill him. Oh, okay, we have a library faction. Let's call my allies into this as well. Okay, finally we managed to win this war. Let's enforce our demands. And we're gonna get all of these guys on my prison. I'm gonna revoke their titles. One by one. Oh, okay, I have a truce with this guy, so I can revoke his title right away. But I can revoke this title, I'm gonna do that. And I just disinherited my second son because I want to give these tiles to my first son. Mm, that's a lot of money, that's good. But we have to say no, so... Okay. okay guys, as you can see, this guy hates me a lot, so I'm gonna revoke his title. I don't care if we're gonna get tyranny because at this point everyone hates me. Here we go. And I'm gonna give this counties to my second son. Oh, okay. It seems this guy just escaped my prison. Okay, normally I would imprison them, but this time I have to choose this one. And we managed to win this library war. So let's enforce our demands. So we need these counties on my nose and these counties from Holy Roman Empire. Okay guys, I sort out my kingdom. Now we are doing pretty good here. Let's go on a pilgrimage to get some piety. And boom, we got 625 piety, which is really good. Let's sway pop because I want to ask for gold. Okay, it seems I have another son. Okay guys, let's declare on this guy for his duchy. Okay, it seems he has a strong ally here. Oh, my third son just died. Bro, everybody will hate me. Let's try to capture their capital. Nice, we are all the way to 78% war score. Okay guys, it seems we're gonna lose a battle here. Let's get back in. Oh, I have so many injured knights. And finally guys, I think now if we can ask for gold from Pope. Yeah, here we go. Give me the gold Pope. And we lost another battle here. Okay guys, finally we managed to win this bloody war. Let's enforce our demands. And we got this true county. I will just give away this county to random dudes. Who is raiding me? This guy is raiding me right here. Oh no, I just lost my alliance with William. So I will just break this because I don't need it anymore. But we can get another alliance with England, so let's do that. Here we go again. Oh, look at this. We can get the sadistic right here. Ambition is pretty good, but I much prefer sadistic because we can murder our children. What the fuck is wrong with you? Guys, let's stick fever on this guy. They are lonely. They don't have anyone. So that is our best chance to get these counties. Is this from this DLC? I think this is new. I didn't saw this before. I can't remember. Okay, I think this is new as well. She wants to sleep with me? How dare you! And here we go, we managed to win this war. Let's enforce our demands and we got this touchy. Guys, if you choose paranoid over ambition, please go and visit a doctor. Right now I'm just constructing some buildings on my counties. 
okay guys now let's see clever on this guy uh, for this touchy I'm not gonna call my ally I think we can win this far without allies okay guys let's try to catch them here okay they are running so I'm gonna just see just count you oh my god we have another claiming faction stop it get some help okay guys we got their army here okay guys here we go I'm gonna call my allies into the war and we have a peasant uprising as well and we managed to win this war let's enforce demands and now let's go and deal with this big rebels okay guys let's try to catch their army right here and let's siege back our counties and we have another prison uprising <laughs> look at this our prison uprising is fighting with our enemy how funny is that okay guys we managed to win this prison uprising let's enforce our demands and finally we managed to win this for as well let's see for demands and boom finally we got this guy in my prison and I'm gonna rebook all of his titles and now I'm gonna give this duchy to this guy and now this guy only has two county and he's vassal of this guy so I'm gonna just negotiate for release renounce his claim and gain a weak hook okay I cannot gain a weak hook so just that look at this we can get 250 piety here and a medium boost as well for 10 years but yeah we have to say no again nonsense born this raving heretic and we have to refuse this as well okay let's declare on this guy now holy war for this duchy they are pretty weak so that's not gonna be hard you know and by the way, I'm gonna increase my food quality to get this small boost. Okay guys, we got their army right here. Let's continue our sieging progress here. Oh, my son died in battle. Perfect. Okay, it seems my son was slain by this guy. Yeah, sure, I will kill this guy. But it seems we have a grandson, so we still have an heir. Okay guys, finally we managed to win this war. Let's enforce our demands and get this beautiful duchy as well. Okay, we're gonna have a crusade here for Jerusalem. Okay, let's declare on this guy for this duchy now. And we managed to win this far only with one battle, which is really good. Let's see for our demands. And we got this touchy as well. And now it remains only two counties to get. Then I have to attack Holy Roman Empire for these counties. Okay, now that we got all of this, I'm gonna switch to learning for this small boost. Okay, let's deliver on this guy to get this last piece of county. Okay guys, it seems because I'm fighting a hostile faith, I'm not forced to join the crusade, which is new to me. I don't think this option was available before, but let me know in comments, please. Okay guys, we managed to win this war, let's enforce our demands. And now it remains only this country to get. Guys, you know what? It's gonna be much easier to get counties from Holy Roman Empire within, rather than attack them from outside. So I'm gonna swear fealty to them for allow feudal obligations. Here we go. Okay guys, it seems we cannot declare war on anybody because my leech has current authority level 3. So I'm gonna modify feudal contract and I'm gonna give some of my tax away. And I will get this, which means the vessel can declare war regardless of leech current authority, which is really good. And guys, I'm gonna get a claim on this county because it has gold mine. Okay guys, let's see clever on this guy for this county. Okay, that is really nice. My leech chose me as his swordship, which means I'm gonna get 3 gold per month, 20% more domain tax, and minus 20% building construction cost. Okay, this event is new. 
I can start the murder scheme against this my rival. And here we go, we managed to win this war. Let's see for our demands and get this piece of county. Guys, let's invite claimants here. Maybe we can get someone useful. Oh my god, 750 prestige. That is so expensive. Guys, let's get some armored footmen here. I'm gonna get two of this and increase size of this as well. And let's get some pikemen as well. Why not? Oh my god, we're gonna get 100 stress from this decision. Okay, guys, now we're gonna get a claim on this county. And I'm gonna get a powerful ally here. And let's deliver on this guy. Okay, guys, we're gonna have a huge battle here. And we managed to win. Okay, guys, let's attack their army right there. It says you will probably lose, but I don't think so. Yeah, let's attack them. That was a close one. That was a close one. But we managed to win and we managed to win the war as well. Let's enforce our demands and we got this piece of county which I'm gonna keep it for myself. Okay guys, let's do this. And I'm gonna demand help from my liege to increase control on my county. We have a 47 chance of success. And yeah, we did it. Okay guys, it seems this vassal has a claim on all of this duchy, which is really good. I just need some prestige. I'm gonna call a hunt to get some prestige here. Oh, look at this. If we choose this, we will lose 150 prestige. But if we choose this, we have a 27 chance to die. Oh my god. Mm, let's choose. Oh my god, that was really risky. Bruh. Okay, that was unexpected. We're gonna play as my grandson right now. Let's make an alliance with England again. Okay guys, we have a claiming faction here and we have a loyalty faction. Okay guys, I got a claim on this guy. Let's see if on them. But they are same string as we are, so it doesn't matter. Okay guys, you managed to win this far without a single battle. Here we go. Look at this, we have a big independence war. I wonder why Holy Roman Empire has this part of France. Okay, we are a grown up man now. I will get prestige here. And I will focus on his stewardship. Okay, now that we have enough prestige, let's deliver on this guy for this duchy ok guys we are all the way to 90% war score and here we go we managed to win this war and we are gonna get all of these counties so our next target is gonna be this guy let's get a claim on him let's call a hunt wait what it seems my aunt wants to kill me let's get help from my friend here I cannot believe that Buzana had the nerve to plot against me to murder her own nephew. Yeah, buddy, you have to be careful. Well, I'm gonna expose his secret and I'm gonna arrest her. And I'm gonna torture her because why not? She tried to murder me. And my aunt just died, but now we don't have any player air from my dynasty. Okay, guys, here I'm gonna wrap up the video. We made a pretty good progress here and it's a pretty fun challenge that we can only say no in all of our decisions. In next part, I will unite the West Slavs. So real question here is, it is worth to buy the Ferns and Foes DLC? Well, yes and no. If you are part of those guys who doesn't care about the storylines and reading and stuff, I wouldn't recommend to buy this DLC. Otherwise, yes, it worth to buy because it adds loads and loads of events and new scenarios to game. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video, please do me a favor, drop a like and subscribe to my channel. Take care of yourself and I will see you in next one.